Hello and happy Thursday. This is Shelly and I'm here today with your Thrive Thursday, where every Thursday I'm bringing you tips and ideas to make sure that your gym is thriving and you are continuing to grow. Today we're gonna to talk a little bit about systems, systems, systems. So this week I have realized that if you don't have the proper systems in place for missing people in your gym, life is gonna be crazy. My office manager's husband unfortunately has COVID, so she has been out and will be out for two weeks, and I've realized two things during that time. A, my office manager needs a raise, and B, it is hard work answering phones. So I know so many of you are probably in a position where you don't have an office manager. I was there for a long, long time, and that means that you're the one constantly answering your phones. So every time you pick up that phone call, you're taking away from what you're doing, losing track of where you were, and not being able to get as much done and be productive in your business. Hence working in the business, not on the business. And remember, most of our time wants to be spent working on our business so we are making more money for our gym and helping our gym to thrive. So if you are at the point where you aren't ready for an office manager yet, I want you to create a system for answering the phone. Does this mean that your phone is only answered between X hours and X hours, maybe that's 12 to two every day. You're answering calls and every other time during the day, you're letting those go to voicemail and then you're returning those during that 12 to two's time slot. Now, what does that system look like? So you should have a system that has a script for exactly what somebody's saying. So when they call, they know exactly, they are being answered in a professional manner and exact, know exactly what to say. For instance, if you call my gym at any point during the day or evening, the phone's gonna be answered with Five Star Athletics, this is Shelly or whoever it is, how can I help you? Okay, so a consistent greeting so they know what to expect when they call your business, okay? I suggest you also have in this system common questions that are asked and answers. So, you know, I wanna get my child started in your program. How do I do that? Great, here's what you do and have those steps so anybody in your in your business can answer those calls and answer those questions. There's always gonna be one-off questions that maybe someone that's answering the phone can't answer, so you wanna have a script also written for what to do in that case. You know, Let me find this answer out for you and I'll have someone get right back to you. So phone system is so important, guys. Make sure that you've got that in place, operating and running so your customers are getting taken care of and people are always getting the answers they need and you're not constantly being stopped and distracted by the phone ringing. System number two I want you to make sure you have in place is an opening procedure. When you walk in the door every day, the first person that comes in should have a system in place for what they need to do to open the gym. Okay, what does that look like? And it may seem silly to you, but I want as detailed as unlock the door, turn on every light in the gym, make sure that, you know, mats are probably things are in place they were done the night before and things are set up ready to go. You know, do you need to fill sanitation stations now that we have this stuff with COVID going on? What needs to happen every day with opening, okay? And then how are they held accountable for that? And system number three is the same, but on the opposite end, it is your closing procedure, okay? So every day, how does it look for a closing to happen? What does your front office staff do? What do your coaches do? The last person out the door, what are the things they need to do? You need to make sure that these things are in place so you have consistency in your program and always know what to expect when you walk in and out of the door. I challenge you guys to get these three systems written today. Do these in the next week before next week's Thrive Thursday. Make sure that if you already have these in place, guys, go back and recheck them. We should constantly be looking at our systems, what's working, not what's not working, and talk to your staff for feedback, all right? So my challenge to you this week is to write those top three systems that you need in your business. A phone system, an opening procedure, and a closing procedure. Get those systems documented, done, and when you have them done, comment that they're done on here. So I know that you've taken action and you're getting things done in your business to ensure that you are thriving. Guys, watch next week, because early next week we have a huge announcement coming your way and we're really excited to have you check it out. We'll talk to you all soon and I'll see you next Thursday for next week's Thrive Thursday.